Coming in and going out and coming in and going out. It'll take about, oh, usually three days before they forget that they had lambs that they need to worry about. So is there any chance you can tell which one of these is Weird Al? <laughs> yep, he's the one that looks like a beagle. figured that one that one and that one all would have had them already yeah because their bags are huge and they're huge but the one over there and the her, old gal her the old belly one, she's been sunk in for a while yeah like her belly dropped two weeks ago so yep. i figured she was gonna have it gonna have it so so nope they're all gonna wait until the day when we're busy
she's knuckled over on that leg. We're gonna go ahead and wrap it and see if we can't get it straightened out. figure out how to straighten it on her own and we can pull the wrapping off. It's kind of crazy, but we are empty on that side. We've got two in the intermediate pen that tomorrow will go into the big pen. And we have these four that will go into the intermediate pen tomorrow. Although, maybe not her. We might keep her contained for a little bit longer. Come on, girls. <laughs> I'm feeling pretty good about the rams we kept this year. So, we have Maestro over here and Tesla over here, and Led Zeppelin over here, and where'd he go? And then we have Monster here, and where'd Todd go? Oh, <laughs> he's way down there. And I'm only keeping one other Ram. So that's six this year. That's actually pretty good for me. Good morning. I'm really hoping there's lambs. We are down to our last five and I'm, I'm kind of hoping that at least three of them have lamb this morning. The other two, I just don't know when they're gonna lamb. Their bags are big, their bellies have dropped, but they're holding out. So let's go check for lambs and then feed bottle babies. And we have two more that I pulled out of the big pen yesterday because they just weren't looking great. I don't know if mom isn't making enough milk. I know on one of them she probably isn't because she's in really bad body condition. 
I don't know if she got something and because she was out with the flock, we just never really noticed it, but her hair is pulling off. Um, she's just really skinny and I don't know that she can make milk enough. I mean, she had triplets. We grafted one onto another ewe and we left two on her and one of them's doing fabulous. One of them's doing so-so. So I pulled that lamb. I don't think she has enough milk to support two. And then the other one, I'm not really sure what the deal is. Mom looks great. Her udder looks great. She's making lots of milk, but this lamb is just not doing well. She, she has really sharp teeth. So I'm wondering if mom's not letting her nurse because of those teeth. So we just pulled them in. So now we have five bottle babies and hopefully that's all we'll have. We got babies. Oh, please let them both be girls. They won't be because my sheep are conspiring against me this year. But oh, it would be so nice if they were both girls. They're both boys. Oh well, maybe next year. And then there were four. I actually figured her and her would have had their lambs a little bit ago. But both of these two, any day now. Kind of like the Pied Piper of sheep. We threw the boys out on pasture, so they all have to come. Training in progress. I feel like waiting for the last lamb, used to lamb, is like waiting for the first used to lamb. They just can't come fast enough. That mom looking at us, twins. And she really wants nothing to do with either one. She actually had triplets. And we lost one of them, the second one born because she never cleaned it off and we didn't realize that she had popped a second one out. And we just barely caught, that. my husband just barely caught this third one as it was born. And same thing, had he not run over there, it was still in the sack, it hadn't broke, she didn't care. So we're able to get it out of the sack and now we need to put straw in a jug and get her in with those lambs, make sure they eat and she will probably go away. I don't keep crappy moms like that. No, I won't. I got them pinched pretty tight. Really? Mm -hmm. Why? Because you're kind of awesome at this. Why am I awesome at this? That too. Because now we can send it to Casey and tell him exactly. what will happen if he doesn't That's where, yep. He knows <laughs> That's exactly. Oh, I did lose one. Oh, put your deal in there and then pull it through. Pull it through. No, I had him And then now. Two or one. Okay. See how well that works? You want to do this? Two little lambs from last night are doing better. But Mama still has no milk. So, I don't know if she's got an issue. She is really skinny and no milk. And for as good a feed as she's been on, apparently she's got issues. And no babies from my last three years. So hopefully before the end of today, I will have some more lambs.